the Quadrennial uh, Diplomacy and Development Review. And it is the first time uh, the State Department and USAID have stood back and said, what are our priorities? Where are we going? How are we going to get there? How are we going to do what we do better? Uh, which is something all government institutions have to do in democratic countries. Uh, what is really significant here is that for the first time, diplomacy and development are working together. Uh, that we're not just talking about our foreign policy in terms of our diplomats traveling around the world and working with other governments. We're also talking about our development professionals on the ground helping uh, other countries in health and in agriculture and education and uh, mitigating climate change. And that's really a different understanding of our foreign policy. This process is hard and uh, it, it, it just, it's taken us well over a year. I think it's enormously valuable. It's valuable because bureaucracies are like large ships, you know, they're going in a particular direction, they're hard to turn. You, it's very important to have a required process that says stand back look at the overall direction of where we're going, look at how we're getting there, and really do that from not the perspective of day-to-day -day crises, but the perspective of four years, eight years, 12 years, these are quadrennial reviews. So I think it's enormously important. More and more US government agencies are doing quadrennial reviews. And again, it also helps us explain to taxpayers exactly how we are spending their money.